Understandably, you all have a lot of questions about vaccines, and we're working to answer as many as we can. One that we're getting a lot is if you've had COVID already, do you still need the vaccine? Rob Harris says he has the perfect guy to answer that question for us this morning. Yeah, so you may know Dr. Al Knabel from the City Council in New Albany. So he's a doctor. That's, of course, a good source to talk to any medical question. But he's also had COVID, check two, and he got the COVID vaccine this week, check three. So the CDC is recommending that those who have contracted the virus to still get the vaccine when their time comes. I had Dr. Knabel explain why he thinks it's an important step to do. I think the chances of getting COVID a second time, although they're not zero, uh, if, you, if you've had it, more than likely you're going to build some antibodies. But the big question is we don't know how long those antibodies are going to last. In my particular line of work, I'm up close and personal with several patients every day. And, and uh, the honest truth on this is I just I, I did not want to give this to anybody. If you look at the data now, yes, uh, most people who've had COVID have some antibodies. But again, how long do they last and how protective are those antibodies? So the last thing I want is to be in an uncertain window have those native antibodies that I earned drop off, have a period of time where they're nil, and I, I could end up being a carrier or get it a second time and then give it to somebody else. I do not want to put anybody else at risk, my patients, my staff, my family. Dr. Knabel also told me yesterday that he's one of the ones that's had this really weird side effect where his sense of taste and smell come and go even now that he's feeling better. So I had him talk about that, and he's going to fill us more in about that this weekend on Wake Up at Night Team. Back to you.